Hello everyone, and welcome back. I'm just posting this video because um, the last farmhouse video when I was playing around with the lathe, there were a lot of people that knew quite a bit about lathes, way more than I do, and I want to get a chuck for the end of this, you know, to hold the stock or whatever it is. And I've been looking at the Nova ones, they look pretty good, maybe you guys have a better suggestion of one to get. I don't want to be spending $300 on one, I'm not going to use it all that much, but I will use it. And But with the Novas, maybe they have an adapter, but they come and it has, with like a one inch here, and it's like eight. And this one here is a three quarter, and I don't know how many per inch. I guess I have this little stopper right here that I could pull off and see, because all I have right here sticking out is well, 11 sixteenths, I don't know if they, maybe 5 eighths, I mean, it's showing 11 sixteenths right here. But anyway, I need to know how to to do that, and I don't know what lathe this is. I was looking all over, I just assumed it was a Craftsman, um, but there's no name on it, there's no tag like my, uh, my joiner has, you know, there's just nothing on here that says, maybe it would say on the bottom, but I'm not going to pull this off, and I don't feel any any tags down there so I'm trying to get this done fast because it's only 12 degrees out and I don't have the heat going in here yet I think that's too small Maybe you can tell me what this is for. Is this needed? I mean, I, I was just, I've been looking at those chuck things and there's just so many different little variables that are on there that I figured I would just post a video because somebody will know more than I do immediately. Okay, so I have a three quarter inch with 16 turns. I, I did see that number come up quite a bit. So I need to get this to go from a 16, I, I, I need a chuck that'll fit this or an adapter so I can put a chuck on there. So uh, what are you guys' recommendations? Tell me anything you know. Now I already learned from the last video that over here I had the dead center in there and now I have a live center which will be much better so yeah if you guys will teach me here and I'll be a professional in no time and tell me does this need to be on there or not I just oh yeah it does it keeps it from sliding unless of course whatever you put on there new would hold that but anyway guys any uh advice or information you have would be appreciated. Thanks a lot for watching. I will see you guys on the next video.